welcome back for some more city living. So, in the last part we left off, we um, got invited to the romance festival that's gonna be in town in a few minutes. I don't even know. I don't remember. Oh my god. Okay, we need to. We need to. Where's the the thing? The sign. The sign thing. This thing. It's actually gonna be useful this time. Look at that. Let's go read about the romance festival. Oh, okay. <laughs> Uh, romance festival, uh, Saturday, 5 p.m. So, like, now! It's going on now! Oh my god, okay. Um, things you can do. Drink sakura tea. Grab a cup of delicious sakura tea to put you in the perfect mood to mingle. Uh, the perfect proposal. The romance festival is a perfect place to seal the deal. We even have a wedding arch on site for that heat-of-the-moment marriage. Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> Let's get engaged, married, and have kids all on the same day. Anyway, celebration of flowers. Celebrate the romance festival by scattering pe petals in the air. Fun for children and adults. Ask the romance guru. Ask the romance guru any and all of your burning love questions. But be warned, the guru can be brutally honest. We should have Apollo ask for some love advice because we all know his relationships are a mess. Anyway, let's go. Because uh, it's happening now. So let's go. Let's, let's take Emily, which is what we planned on doing. It's going to be like a unofficial date type of thing it's like oh let's go check out this really cool thing oh she has no hair i still haven't <laughs> still haven't went through and fixed everyone's outfits and things we're gonna take paulo i'm gonna take our sister because we haven't seen her and i think she'd love the romance festival because i feel like that would be super cool yeah just hanging out get on the long i hope no okay <laughs> but yeah um i hope it's really pretty i've I have seen it, but like I've never really explored it, so we're gonna go ahead and try out all the things. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, this is our first festival, right? Oh, I love the romance festival. And yeah. <laughs> it's um it's in the fashion district, I believe. Uh I don't know, I don't remember. But yeah. This is exciting. So yeah, so we're taking Emily here. We're taking our sister here. We're just it's kinda it's like a casual hangout type of thing where we're all like let's all chill together at this thing that's has a slightly romantic aura to it so you're just like hmm you know but yeah we're gonna we're gonna hang and we're gonna have fun and we're gonna throw petals everywhere <laughs> i wish that was a thing in real life like imagine just going to some place and like mingling with people and just throwing petals at each other oh look at that oh look it's happening Oh, we missed it. Oh, okay. Nothing happened. Cool. Well, she threw petals at us, so let's throw petals at her. <laughs> um, we don't even know this chick. All right, let's uh, let's give her a friendly introduction. Oh, there's our sister. There, there's everyone. Where's Paolo? Did he not come? <laughs> he was just like, nah. <laughs> oh wait, he's at work. What am I saying? He has work till 9 p.m. Are you gonna miss it? When do, until when does the festival go on? Um, oh yeah, okay, Paolo's busy. When, when does this end? What? What happened? I hear the vibe at the romance festival is pretty cool. Do you want to come check it out with me? Who is this? Who, who are you? Let me know. Oh, okay. I think Marcus just wants to meet singles. Yeah, come on, come on over. Alright, let's, let's throw petals at her. Can we do that? Oh, throw petals. Let's do it. Yeah? Yeah? Wait, no, we're gonna visit. Oh, okay. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Look at that. Look at those eyes. It kind of looks like he's getting down on one knee to, like, propose to her. Like, here. <laughs> have, have my love. And she, she looks slightly confused, like, um, I'm not completely sure what is going on in this situation. I'm not sure if I like this. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's actually watch this interaction without me interrupting and everything all right let's see oh look at how pretty that is yeah yeah that's cool that's cool okay um what all right uh let's kiss someone that's that's a that's not a thing we're gonna do but thanks for the prompt <laughs> actually that's a thing we might do i mean we don't want to disappoint our friend right we don't want to do that let's go pour sakura tea together what happened Did you- okay, I don't know. I don't want to know. But let's get you out of your workout gear, because I feel like that's a very interesting outfit to be running around in. Let's, um, get you into something different. Let's get you into- I don't know. We shall see. 
once this loads. If it ever does. Who knows these things? I don't. Come on. Today, maybe. Actually, tomorrow would be nice too, but today is preferable. So, do we have anything, like, slightly pink? <laughs> no, we don't. But let's get him into this. Because I like this. Alright, let's all go. Let's all come sit together. Let's all sit. Let's all sit. Have a drink. You know. Come on, guys. Oh, look at the cup. Oh, that that was that was nice. Thanks for that. Is there like a like what is in that cup? It looks like there's like strawberries in it or something. Or a flower. We're drinking flowers, guys. <laughs> it looks cute though. All right, let's let's chat with our sister and be like, hey. Uh, ask her, ask her how's it going. Ask her how's life. If she's um, you know how she's doing, cause. We haven't seen her in a few days. You know. Just check up on her. Look at look at um Emily over there going at it for the tea. Oh I, Marcus. Marcus, what are you doing? Are you hitting are you hitting on the girl that we brought here? Is this why you wanted to come over? Of course. Of course it is. God damn. Well we'll we'll be over there in a second. I just wanna go ahead and um give Naomi an apartment key. Because why not? Because she's our sister, and because we want her coming over to our apartment a lot, you know? Yeah? Alright, let me get this photo. This is super cute. She's like, really? For me? We're like, yeah. Yeah, you can have it. <laughs> yeah, why not? Alright. Um, let's go, let's go talk to Emily. This is the whole reason why we brought her here, right? Let's, um, install false confidence. Let's go throw petals at her, too. Throwing petals is fun, right? There's already so much on the floor, we're just gonna add to the pile. We're gonna throw some petals. Toss them. He's like, excuse me, guys. Woo! Yeah. Alright. Let's, um, uh... Compliment art? Like... The art that is here? Or just art in general? Be like, damn, art's really cool. <laughs> um, we're gonna go ahead and uh, joke about getting... Uh, we don't really know her, so maybe it would be a good idea to get to know her. Like, ask her about her day! That's a, that's, that's a thing, right? And uh, ask about her career. And Marcus is like, um... <laughs> um uh discuss some dance techniques those are fun things right uh gossip about sakura tea effects she is a dj what that's so cool okay so she's a dj all right good to know They're probably talking about like, damn, this team makes me feel tingly for some reason. Do you feel that? Do you do you feel the tingles? I feel the tingles. <laughs> do we want to? You know what? Let's go ahead. We do need to kiss someone, so why not? Why not? Let's go flirt with her a little bit and uh, mention the flirty festival vibe and be like, hmm, hmm. What do you What do you think about that? Uh, tell her she looks pretty, cause she does. She really does. She's a very pretty sim. <laughs> Alright, this is going well, right? This is going well. This is what we wanted. This is what the romance festival is all about. Finding... Fi starting... Starting relationships. And, or just finding people. <laughs> having fun. Um, 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 um. I really do wish Paolo was here. He gets off work in a few minutes. In like 10 minutes, actually. What? Ne what? Clara, stop! Clara, stop it! Clara, you're married! <laughs> um, let's go kiss her hands. Is that a little too much? Too forward? We'll see if she'll take it. You know what? Let's go for it. Go big or go home, right? Go big or go home. Um, let's, uh... He's like, no, there's, there's no room, I can't do it. Let's go ahead and, uh, try again. 
Oh, Paula got off work. Okay, let's go. Let's go kiss her hands. Do it. Oh my God, <laughs> Clara, there's your husband, and he's flirting with other people. Now you're now you're mad. But <laughs> when you flirted with me, that was fine, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, Clara, you got. I think they've got some issues going on in that marriage, cause <laughs> that doesn't seem that doesn't seem to be going too well. Um, but now that Paulo's off work, we can uh, bring him here. Let's go. Let's go, Paulo. And he came. Oh, no, that's not him. I was like, and he came like this. <laughs> no, that's not him. But he came in a towel. <laughs> of course, this is proper festival attire, my friend. You know. Let me just stop by the romance festival in a towel. I think you're making some assumptions here. Like, where do you where do you think this is going to go? <laughs> Let's um change into change into the thing all right let's change into your everyday wear i kind of want to give them all a city living makeover which i might do post a video or i might just do it off camera and just show the outfits to you guys later but i think we're gonna go have him ask the romance guru about his love life because as you all know he's got a pr pretty interesting one like look at look at all this look at all these married ladies Anyway, I don't know, maybe he has a thing for married women. Like, if they're not, not married, it just doesn't, like, he, they're not interesting to him. You know, maybe he likes a challenge. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, let's, um, ask about your romantic destiny. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's go do that. While they flirted on up over here. Oh, we- Oh, who kissed who? What happened? <laughs> run any kissing social on sim oh kissing hands that works okay i like that all right let's just um we're just getting to know her he didn't change it okay he wants to stay in his towel that's totally fine by me you can stay in the towel all right let's let's go ask this this guru you know i've got i've got um i got a question for you sir <laughs> I see a lot of woohoo in your future. <laughs> okay. Maybe some love letters? Some romance? Who knows? You know? But it's it's lots of fire. <laughs> I don't think he liked that. <laughs> uh, I don't think he liked that at all. Alright. Yeah, he seems he seems very upset. What happened? Tell me. Why won't you tell me? Your romantic destiny is bleak. Well, yeah, if you keep going after married women, I don't think that's gonna go very far. Alright, let's have him go grab some sakura tea, because that is a thing that he'd be very into. And do you guys hear that music? Let me just be quiet for a minute. Okay. <laughs> I think it kind of, like, stopped and the Sims just started talking. But it's very nice and it's very calming. Did she leave? Emily left. I mean, we was like, bye guys. I'm not gonna deal with this nonsense. Where's our sister? We should just hang with our sister. Is she here? Oh, she's right here. Okay. Um, let's all... Let's all convene in one spot. You know? Let's all... Let's all... Can't we go here together? Okay, go here together. Let's all reconvene in, in the same spot. You know? That we're not all over the place. Oh no, Emily's right there. She didn't leave. She's just hungry. <laughs> yeah. All right. We're waiting on our sister. If she's even coming. No. All right. Cool. Um. Oh wait, no, she's right here. Wonderful. All right. Let's let's flash our crazy eyes to her. She loves it when we do that. <laughs> but um, actually, we are getting kind of hungry. So, we're gonna go ahead and buy ourselves some food. Let's get some... Do, do we do we dare? Yeah, let's go for it. We're gonna go for it. Why not? It's puffer fish, you know? That stuff is, that stuff is entertaining. Oh, he's having a bit... Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> what? <laughs> when was this a thing? Quinn and... Alright. Alright, you guys, you guys go for it. Do, do it... Do your thing, guys. I'm very happy for you. Of course, Marcus has to has to impress everyone with his skills. Maybe he's trying to impress our sister. Maybe Marcus likes our sister. Who knows? Who wouldn't? I'd like his sister. <laughs> his sister's great! <laughs> uh, Alright, let's go get food. Because we're hungry. Really hungry. 
And, uh, yeah. And then let's go get some festival swag. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Let's, um, let's buy swag. And then, did we order the food? I think we did, and we're just not taking it. Let's, let's go eat that before someone else decides it. Okay. I don't even know what's going on. Alright, we're gonna go eat our food, and then we'll buy stuff. Because we can't do both at the same time, apparently. Hmm. Who else is around? We should make friends with people. I don't know what we're doing. Alright. Ooh, there's, there's a mixologist here. Oh, that's so nice. I didn't know that they put that there. Alright, we're all having a bit of trouble with chopsticks. Where are you going? You're going to, to chat with someone. Sure. Why not? Alright. Oh, okay. That was cool. That was great. That was nice. I liked that, right? Alright, let's go let's go eat this. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna speed on through so that they can they can eat their food. Oh, that was the wrong person. Wonderful. Alright, why don't you go eat this then? Oh, someone already took it. I think she took it. Did you take my puffer fish? Alright. Alright, congratulations! Colton has taken his first steps on the on his culinary journey through the city. Eating food from the city unlocks the ability to cook it. There are 26 more recipes to learn. Go out and try more food. You don't gotta tell me twice. I love trying food. Um, we're gonna go... We're gonna go... Alright, no... Are you hungry? You are not hungry. Why am I looking for food for you? Let's go buy some swag! Like I've been trying to do for the past five minutes. Go! I command you. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. Um, there's snow globes! Oh, right! I completely forgot that we can go around and dig through things and find snow globes. But I don't think- I don't think they're the snow globe collecting type. But I do want some fireworks, because I feel like that would be really cool. And a sparkler! Yeah! Alright, awesome! Oh, I keep forgetting that we're poor and that we need to pay rent. Um, whoops. But, uh, let's go light some fireworks. Let's- let's go in the center. Go here. Into the middle. Straight- straight dead center. And, uh, let's go... Place. We should have done place and light, but whatever. Let's place that, and then let's light it. And then we're all gonna come here. Okay. Can we all- Oh, he's gonna- <laughs> Don't extinguish it. Let's go here. Let's all watch it. Oh! Oh, they all come automatically. Oh, look at that! That didn't even go that far. That's okay. Let's, um, let's... Place and light. Oh, the festival's ending in an hour. Okay, cool. We're just gonna light these last few. Um, Emily, you might want to get away from that. Um, okay, it didn't work out. That's fine. <laughs> Can we do anything with it? Or is it just, like, busted? Alright, cool. Alright. Is it, does this one not work either? I was about to say. Whoa! Whoa. Oh! Oh, that's so cute! Look at that! That's so pretty! <laughs> oh, that one, that one was just- Oh, okay. Aww. Aww, that was so nice! Alright. And then we can save the sparkler for later, that's totally fine. Um, does Paolo know our sister? That would be really surprising if he didn't. He does. Okay, cool. Let's, um, let's have him go say hello. You know? Discuss favorite bands. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> just, just talk. What are you off doing? Nothing, you're just standing there. Alright. Well, uh, let's go, let's go ask the romance guru about our romantic destiny. Oh yeah, no, let's ask him for his wisdom. And be like, so, you see that girl over there? You know? We're like, yeah, you see that girl over there? Yeah, I kind of really like her. Kinda. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Give her a rose. Girls love roses. <laughs> a plus advice from the guru. <laughs> okay. Let's see how this turns out. Let's see what he says. Is it good advice? Bad advice? Any advice? 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, it seems like good advice. Love is the fountain of eternal youth from which we can all drink from. Okay, that was terrible advice. That doesn't- that doesn't- that doesn't do anything. <laughs> that doesn't mean anything to me. Sir! Sir, come back! <laughs> I'm not satisfied. Please! Oh well, okay, well... I- maybe that means, um... I don't know, don't waste any time? Let's go... Let's go, um... Let's go hug her, you know? We'll be like, oh, thank you so much for, for coming out to see me and stuff. I know, okay, we're we're just following her. This looks extremely creepy. You know, we're gonna be like, thanks so much for coming out. You know, I had a great time. Oh! Oh, look at that. Oh, she's flirting with us. Look at that. Okay, I think she likes it back. This is great! Uh, I think the festival is over? Yeah, yeah. It's like deconstructing! right before our eyes that's actually really cool so we're gonna go ahead and disband this group because we're tired and we have work tomorrow oh they're hugging again all right all right i think this was successful we're gonna go ahead and disband this group and uh we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and um we're gonna can we give her a rose let's give her a rose because that's what the guru said to do and then we're gonna go ahead and say goodbye to her and go home because this was really fun, and we had a really great time out, and Paula's just getting more food. <laughs> she seems to be having trouble over here. But, uh, Paula's just always hungry. <laughs> so is Naomi. Let's complain to her about our problems and be like... <laughs> we have... Alright. Colton's gonna go home, because he had a great time. We're gonna be like, we have so many issues. It's not even funny. Work is hard. None of all my relationships are not even relationships. They're just they're they're not even a thing. I don't know what to do <laughs> All right, we have learned a new recipe and we have 26 more to unlock and we all decided to stand because the table disappeared and There's a random book on the floor. Good. Good to know You know We're gonna Um Yeah She's just like, dude, you need to suck it up. Look, I know life is hard, but you just, you, you, <laughs> you can't just complain about things all the time, you know? <laughs> I don't know, maybe Paula's, maybe Paula's just having a rough time. Maybe, what's going on? They're discussing food, you know? Maybe Paula's just not, I don't know. Maybe he just needs advice, needs someone to like, to like talk to. Let's, let's ask her about her day and be like, how was your day? I can't be the only one that had a terrible day. Maybe he just had a bad day. Like maybe, I don't know. Who knows what's going on? You know, she was just, she's just here listening to us, talking to us about our problems, <laughs> you know? Maybe... Let's let's go give her a hug and tell her thanks for the advice. Like even though even though it wasn't it wasn't the best, but it was it was nice. Thank you. <laughs> I'll I'll try and suck it up more. <laughs> no, but um, she does have a point. You know, we need to get over ourselves. We are now living on our own. You know, Paulo used to live in a house full of people, but this is like, and they they were all like they were all like his family because. He doesn't really- he's, he's never really had- What? Dude, what? <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you- What? What is going on? Sir! Sir, this is not like- I mean, we're one to talk. We showed up in a towel, but still, we weren't running around like a crazy man. Like, dude! <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Where are you going? I'm so confused. What is going on? Sir! Sir, please. Sir- Go back, go back to your house, and uh, step back in the shower. Did he get? Did you get scared by something? Oh, and he disappeared. All right, lovely. Well, <laughs> uh, it's the crazy city. What do you? What do you expect? But where was I? <laughs> oh yeah, Paulo and his problems. So yeah, so he came from like he's never really had a family. Like he has a family, but. They're, they weren't really ever really there for him. So as soon as he was able to, he moved out with a bunch of his friends and they were his family. And, but then they all started like, then he 
and he loved them and they loved him and they all lived together and it was great and it was fun and he's never really been on his own like he is now like all yes he does have colton but at the same time like they're they are best friends but it's not the same like they're not they're best friends but they're like they're living together as two separate people so he has his own separate life whereas when he was living with with his group of friends they were all kind of interconnected and he like he has a job now he has responsibilities now he has rent to pay like the house that they used to live in was owned by one of the people and it was just it wasn't as as hard as it is now and he's like he's struggling <laughs> colton seriously i just found out that i found this concert at an underground abandoned warehouse in the fashion district okay we have to go let's head out around 10 and make sure that we can get in what is this? What underground abandoned warehouse of the fashion district are you talking about? This concert? What? Okay, it's our sister. She's inviting us. So yeah, of course we're going to say yes. We're going to go. But like I was saying, it's just kind of hard for Paulo to like, I don't know, be independent. He didn't think it was going to be this hard, but it is. And so he was just kind of complaining and, uh, you know. Like, letting out his frustrations. And Naomi was there, and it was sweet, and it was nice. But I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this part here, and in the next part, I'm thinking we have Colton take Emily out, you know? Because they had a really great time, and I think it would be really cute to just take her out on a date. That is after work, because we do have work tomorrow. Yes, we do. Wonderful. All right. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like, drop a comment, and stay tuned for the next part. Bye, guys.